It's Straight Jacket Day here at Mucus Asylum Stadium here in Luniapolis, Craziana, home of the Insane Colts. The first 1,000 fans will receive a free straight jacket in a 500 volt lobotomy. Am I crazy? Or did I just see a fan throw himself off the upper deck in a garbage can with an M80 in his mouth? No, that's their mascot, Crazy Jimmy. <laughs> Quite the entertainer, isn't he? Today's matchup is going to be complete mayhem. The teams are taking the field. The Micro Hard Mutilators face off against the Insane Colts. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> everyone grim blitzrow with you on mfl game day hey uh bricks do you smell something burning ah uh, thanks for reminding me i left my rubber foot in the toast trap and then warm it up last time i left it there too long it came out like saganaki oh uh -huh. it's freezing in here hey why don't you take a shampoo and ouzo stick your head in the toaster oven that'll warm you up And it's first and ten. Oh, man, Bricks, you gotta love a player who goes down fighting. And it's first and ten. Hot one, hot two. First down. He was not going to drop that one. They need to make him a target more often. And it's first and ten. And this guy is super devastating. Hit knocks the ball loose. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. He's at the 40. He's at the 30. He's at the 20. The 10. Here comes the defense. <laughs> Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? Goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. And it's first and ten. One. Nice run for five yards. Second down and five. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Three. He had nowhere to go and got nothing out of it. Third down and five. Hot. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Hey, man, I just can't want to sell him. I don't want to hear what I'm selling him. And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. And he put all of his foot into that one. The return man catches the ball, oh, and he looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. Yeah, it sounds like my offseason. And it's first and ten. Oh, that was a great throw and a great catch. Yeah, but, but it was an interception. Oh, yeah. Oh, man, he just crushed him. <laughs> 
I gotta see. And there is nothing in the rule book for that penalty. The ref appears to be cheating. He's just making shit up. First down and inches. The defense had enough with this ref and jumps off sides to kill him. <laughs> And it's first and ten. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have... Oh, he fumbled that one. Everyone loves being on the highlight reel, leaping over a defender, but sometimes you get... I know I just said, never hit a man when he's down. He's just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. Destruction in his path. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? Second down and five. Another turnover for the defense. Wow, he got mugged. Boy, like a mafia hit. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. And the ball is lateral to his teammate. We're talking street ball. And that's a first down. Looks like they're just gonna pound it up the middle all night, Bricks. I call that the honeymoon offense. I'm not gonna touch that one. That's what she said. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 And he just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. He's running out of gas now. He scores! What in the fuck am I watching? And wasn't this guy in a lost wig just all male dance from you before he signed? Yeah, they were called nuts and bolts. His face name was Vice Rip. Okay, nice and easy like a two foot putt. You miss two foot putts all the time, Grim. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And it's first and ten. Hot one. Quarterback threads the needle for a first in. Oh, mama. Just call him Cap and Crunch. Another one bites the dust. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 And that's perfect coverage. Nice deflection. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. Oh, and that one's gonna hurt. He may not be able to comprehend math after that hit. What's math? Exactly. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot. When I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. 
thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. And the cornerback is down. Zoom in on his face. I want to see if the little bastard's crying. <laughs> And that'll bring up third down and seven. Hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. They go to the ground game and pick up the first. Night oh, you knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon Ravy blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. And it's first and ten. He is fighting for every yard. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the MFL. And the offense has only two running backs left, and the defense is licking their lips. I think they want to hit those last two runners for this outfit. And it's first and ten. That's the end of quarter one. Well, the good news is there's still time to make it a game. And there's still time to get a beer. And it's first and ten. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? If you don't kill this ref with the attack ref dirty trick, you're gonna lose, pal. Yeah, you kind of deserve it if you're this dead scrim. The offense is down to their last running back. If they lose him, they lose all their running plays. First down and less than a defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. First down and one. of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest tits? Ref! And that'll bring up second and one. And they line up for the extra point. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What do you do then? Run. First and ten. Oh, great tackle! Bingo! Bingo! I just hit that mutant bingo! And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays! Talk about luck! The offense is running low on running backs. They have only two left. They need to conserve those runners now and consider passing more. And it's first and ten. Talking about Butterfingers, he 
should have had that one. Second down and ten. And an eight-yard gain on that one. Like when Bricks' mom decided to move back in with us. Third and two. The players go to dirt. They've been known to rip the heads off of enemy players. This is going to be a long kick. Let's see if he can make it. Straight through the uprights. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. And it's first and ten. Send a message without him. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, uh, going in circles. <laughs> the offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, win. they say what kind of And it's first and ten. Man, this guy's running like an old guy. Oh, man, he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. Gotta love it. He should bite his head off for an encore grin. I won't even get out of The offense has only one quarterback left. If he dies, it's game over. Yeah, this new QB, he don't even look too confident. He's bleeding with the coach on the sidelines about something. Yeah, he's telling his coach to punt. What a pussy. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot eight. And he laterals the ball. Man, these guys are like, oh, no. Is getting kills. Uh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. And it's first and ten. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. And it's first and ten. Get your motor running. It's chainsaw time. No doubt about it, that guy is dead. He says, I'm taking you with me. The offense is down to their last running back. When he bites the dust, they can only pass. That's right, but now the defense can focus on killing the receivers. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot Hot, 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 hot. 
QB looks angry at his offensive line, and I can't blame him. Yo, man, nobody can touch me when I'm off. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? Third down, and the QB is saying his prayers. Hot one, hot two. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? Because I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> No, they couldn't pick up a first down, so now they have to punt. Nice punt! Should move him back nicely. Nice catch, and he turns on the afterburners! Punt returners in this league have a life expectancy. Oh, what a brutal hit! And it's first and ten. Second down in a lot. And there's an eight-yard catch. Chipping away with those medium passes. I like it. Like a patient prison break. Third down and five. Tired of it. And look at the QB run for his life. He's so fast. Nah, he just found out about that cheerleader's pregnancy test. I'd run too. She's huge. And it's first and ten. Kind of it out of bounds. That's better than throwing a pick, I suppose. Second down and ten. Oh, man, Bricks, you've got to love a player who goes down fighting. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. I don't think you can say that, Graham. The offense lost their last running back on the previous play. Next time the offense comes out in the field, they will have no running plays. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. And he snags it for six. Touchdown. Touchdown. Hey, Bricks, they're going for two here. Point attempt. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. He refuses to go down. And that's a hell of a cheap shot. <laughs> Gotta love it. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And it's first and ten. Point with multiple interceptions, the QB should just throw in the towel. Yeah. Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo! All I need 
is 77. Oh, holy Montezuma's revenge. That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Bricks? Wonder what made him so mad. That was probably all the diarrhea. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort, and he just got so mad and cursed anyone who came to Mexico forever to crack their pants. Uh, sounds like he didn't really think it through, because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but they got out the gas. What the fuck are you talking about? Uh, I don't really know right now. What day is it? And the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Grim, what's the hurry-up offense? There's no huddle. The offense calls plays at the line of scrimmage and plays really fast. Why would they do it? And he's off to the races. First and ten. Under two minutes of timeout means the QB is playing beat the clock, and he better win. And the offense goes into a hurry up to pick up the pace of the game. Hot two. Hot. Hot. The defender says, I don't think so. When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! They want more points, so they're going for two. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. That, my friends, was an all. Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the MFL. to try to conserve time. Caught for the first down. Oh, holy smokes. He just killed that player with a cheap shot. That's why we love the MFL. It's a close battle as the quarter ends. Halftime is brought to you by those caring folks at Monsatan Industries. They make the world a better place by making the government tell you it is. It's anyone's game as the third quarter begins. Both teams have taken their performance-enhancing drugs, and everyone is ready to rock and roll. The teams line up for the second-half kickoff. <laughs> the best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. force meets the explodable object. The burn returner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot eight. And the defense gets another pick. Man. 
rough day. Oh, with the brain scrambler. And it's first and ten. Oh, and the defense jumps off sides of the tank. You know, in some leagues, you aren't even allowed to touch the QB. In the NFL, yeah. they have plays just for killing them. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. The offense has only two quarterbacks remaining on the roster. They better be careful because when those guys die, it's forfeit city. And it's first and ten. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. He's at the party. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Uh, Good night to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. The 20. He's at the 10. And into the end zone with a burst of speed. I think he's more of a... Hmm. I don't remember that being an officially sanctioned NFL rule. The offense is losing quarterbacks faster than teams lose their minds at spring break. They're down to their last QB before they have to forfeit. First and goal. It's a jailbreak, and the defense jumps offside to kill the ref. Oh, crowd's loving it. First down and three. Oh, great catch! And that's a touchdown! Touchdown! <laughs> and these guys think kicking is for pussies, Bricks. They're going for two. Yeah, they got big balls, Glenn. Yeah, bigger than yours. Boom! Dead and down! He delivered the freaky fast ham a sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? No, nah, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. Just catch it, run it back, and don't die. First and ten. Hot one, hot two, hot three. Oh, and they just deflated the quarterback's balls right there. Second down and more than the QB would like. Third and two. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. 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 Good thing they don't have drug testing in the And he just popped his eyes in the back of his head. That quarterback's going to be hurting. Or dead. Or worse. You want to do some fun on your time. Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. And he got it off. That's a decent punt. He's got the ball now and he's going to try. You've got to avoid those spikes or you'll be a mutant pincushion. I was a chubby kid, Grim. My parents sent me to fat camp. With no one left on their roster, the insane Colts take a brutal loss by forfeit. They battled hard but didn't have enough to get it done. They should be ashamed of themselves. I know I am. Once again, the folks at Evil SM thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.